Hey, how are you doing folks? So as you see, got the new shirts and I'm back from the show. So updates. I lost the video camera. This is a new camera, so we'll see how it is. Uh, hopefully, so far it looks it looks really nice and clean on the on the viewfinder. But we'll see. I did buy the one of the outdoor ones because I wasn't happy with the outdoor videos for the with that contour I have. So we'll see. Hopefully it will you know do decent videos here and also nice videos outdoors. It's one of those waterproof Nikon. So new T-shirts. Not gonna be selling them yet because I'm waiting for. I'm getting some keychains and uh, hats, like baseball caps or whatever you call it, and also bandanas. So once those are here, that's when I'm gonna, you know, make a video with the. I have to think of the system, what system I'm gonna do. Probably not the t shirts, are probably not gonna be through Gear Bastion because it's just. Uh, I will be. It's just too much and it would be people would not like the gear bash on the emails and all that stuff so this will be probably some some kind of a direct sales I have all different sizes the SML extra large extra extra large and triple extra large so you see one change is now it says Gavco knives on the front the logo on the heart but the back I changed the design to something I was really excited about people on Instagram already seen this so we see Gavco knives gear bash and websites don't cut yourself and with the big logo and all the kind of main models it's not all the models I have but all the main models of knives or the you know popular models so we have the extra little brick foot flippers the fixed blade EDC friction folder EDC warney that's the necker until now pretty much it was called ultra light necker but I just called it necker EDC frame like EDC T-Rex Sharky and Camp 8 8 inch camp knife EDC, it's just all the EDC because it is the EDC carry. It's one of those sizes that everybody can carry it all the time. So that's why all, all kind of like just change the name for EDC. And I really like it because it's, I think it's cool. I know some graphic designers will not be happy with it, but you know, I don't care. People liked it. I had really good feedback and uh, it makes me happy. And <laughs> I think that's what counts. So we have plenty of these. The caps will be pretty cool. The keychains. The reason why I'm waiting for the rest of the this stuff to start selling them because I want to be able to, if people will want, you know, the cap and the shirt to be able to ship it all together, and uh, the keychains as well and bandanas. The thing with bandanas, I will probably the folders from now on. Once I get the bandanas, the folder will not probably come with the in these pouches. And the traditional you know folder custom folder pouches but I will probably wrap them nice in bandana I think it's gonna be a nice touch and uh, probably even the fixed blades I'm thinking I'll have to see you know how much money it is I think the keychains it's gonna be just a very basic keychains as aluminum carabiner with the little nylon uh, strap and the key ring I'm pretty sure that those will be free pretty much with everything because I think they are really cheap so I think they will be always free with any knife that I sell uh, but they will be also available probably for sale like with the shirt like a package So that's that and new knives uh, Stuff from Warjet uh, Stamp them whole day today. I was stamping so my forearm is pretty pumped up from the from the big hammer five pound I think it's a five pounder So we have the neckers the ultra red neckers actually slight little change I designed before I did the second run. It's pretty much the same exact thing but as you see, I drop the, the tip a little lower, make it more of a, almost like a warning, but it still has a little bit of belly. And this gives me still option of doing the nice upswap, but also a little longer with the, you know, you can kind of see the difference. But pretty much the same, the handle is the same. Really popular people really like this in person. The couple I had with me on the show, they sell, sold really, really quick, like everybody wanted them both the regular necker and the pocket clip version as well so that's the new necker just slight slight little change uh, new sharky this is what I was excited about so the new sharky has a facelift kinda you see I went with the lightning slot in the handle and to make it cool I kinda copied exact copy of the, the outside the main tool and I fit it the small little like a micro dashi inside so using the steel while lightening the main tool and make it make it you know wrappable 
which will be which will make it much more popular I think because people like those wrapped handles much lighter and much I think cooler looking and it gives me a little byproduct like a micro dashi that this will be probably really really cheap just a very basic like literally kitchen I mean look it's small like my finger but it still gives you look at that it will have like a half inch small little edge there but I think they're gonna be pretty cool really 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 tiny like those and the uh, EDC has a new you know EDC fixed blade 2.0 here's the original one many many people like it I love it it's it's I sold I think around 200 at this point around, I think around 200 of these yeah so the EDC got little facelift the finger troll ara is exactly the same so what changed is I dropped the blade a little down because I personally like that shape of the hand the shape of the knife like you see on my folders it has that curve you know the negative angle also the handle slightly down it's slightly wider here than it used to be just slightly slightly wider it's slightly microscopically longer you can see here and same thing on the front besides just the dropping it is actually slightly longer and I did kind of more of a traditional hunter style skinner style belly on it that gives me option of you know satisfying hunters for a more of a skinning knife but at the same time I can still just grind it to more of this kind of my traditional shape what I like personally that I would probably call it what the uh, spear point camera doesn't want to zoom uh, focus too, too good yeah I hope it's not gonna be a problem for the future that focus it's I think it looks really nice and crisp there doesn't really want to focus here yeah we'll see hopefully it will work out so that's that and also instead of a bunch of different holes which I never really used because I had certain ideas about it you know when I designed the EDC just dropped it and keep kept the holes what I normally use and made a one big lightning hole there which also will provide me better options for a wrap if I decide to do a wrap version of EDC like I did sometimes in the past for this it's gonna be better this way so that's it guys those are the updates lost camera not a big deal one thing I'm really disappointed I had two videos I didn't do many videos before I lost it but I did two videos that I really wanted to do and I apologize to Jeffrey because I really wanted and you guys too because you you know because I lost it you missed out on a really good video Jeffrey is a friend of my customer of mine we met last year already he makes amazing knives uh, tactical uh, kitchen tactic I think he calls himself he works for the cut Brooklyn in Brooklyn the big you know pretty well-known brand in Brooklyn of uh, kitchen knives and he makes beautiful beautiful knives and also Olami cutlery I finally did a video with Eugene and <laughs> I lost it it was uh, two videos I did were not much but they were I think they were good so I'll definitely have to you know make up for it next time uh, the closest one will be blade show so hopefully I'll see them there and uh, hopefully more of you guys it was great to see many of you guys you know all my friends there you know Sebastian Vance Jeff yeah, Terra Fanatic all the all the winners guys uh, who else was there I'm Sam a lot of lot of people we met you know a lot of people woke up to me and Jeff and everybody and we just hung out we had a great time so guys <laughs> back to work I'm gonna be really busy as you see now not for a little bit because this will this will go to the heater but I have plenty other work that I can do probably still gonna do a couple more folders I have some some projects that I I have to do before too but as always I'm gonna be busy so guys thank you for all the support thank you for watching take care stay safe and remember don't cut yourself